Hello friends, thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of Mark Harville Art Painting Tutorial. And I ask you to please subscribe to that YouTube channel and you can catch all of my other tutorial videos and demos as well. I also appreciate your comments and I want to thank all those who've been making comments and also suggestions on things that folks would like to see me paint. And uh, I hope that these tutorials are, are helpful for you. Let me tell you what I got going on here. I just completed this painting. It's an 18 by 24 stretched canvas and it's all done in acrylic. And I apologize for the noise you hear. That's my grandson in the background kind of hollering. Um, so we'll just work through that. So um, anyway, this is acrylic and uh, I want to take a brief moment and show you how I put this together. Again, thanks so much for tuning in. I really enjoy these nature scenes. I'm always impressed um, as I get out into nature and observe the beauty of the world. And I find it's really important to get away from cities and get away from, from society, really. Um, have a chance to see this beautiful world that God's created and try to find it in its natural state, unadulterated by human hands. And I'm always trying to find opportunities to replicate those beautiful scenes that that the Lord has provided. And I always feel like God is the greatest artist of all. And the way I see the beauty of the color in the sky and how the sky is so versatile and depending on the time and the season, depending on uh, the time of day, depending on the types of clouds in the sky and, and how the sun is positioned in the sky, it seems to make so many interesting, wonderful variety of, of colors and, and of the different style of clouds and how the clouds seem to reflect the, the lighting from the sun. And I always love that. And I love how it can change the mood of the landscape as well. And for me, it's a great honor and a privilege to strive to emulate some of that beauty that the Lord's created and to be able to, in some sense, be a co-creator with the great creator. And I'm grateful that we have the opportunity to have these types of of visions um, and and the beauty that that is all around us. And I love as I paint, striving to create a variety of colors and striving to really try to to show all the different contrast and I really love light and shadow and I'm always looking for opportunities that I can bring in a little bit of contrast into my paintings a little bit of different types of color and um, I love the the lights and the shadows and how they work together and play off each other and I think that's what seems to make a, a beautiful scene in my opinion and I think that that's what uh, many of us enjoy about when we step back and look at a, a painting and how it makes us feel. So my goal is always to strive to create um, just a sense of wonder and appreciation for the beauty that's around us. And there's a lot of ugliness in the world and there's a lot of harsh realities and and uh, I know a lot of people, a lot of, especially in the art world, they tend to 
criticize um, making something too pretty, too sentimental. And that's just unfortunate because there is so much ugliness in the world and why not be able to strive to capture the beauty that we see around us? So I find it important that we just look for the best within ourselves and, and the best of what's around us and trying to create that beauty, even if it's criticized, even if it's considered uh, something that uh, is beneath many people. And so this is what I strive to capture uh, as I do my paintings and in hopes that we can find all the good in the world and all the beauty in the world and all the beauty within each other. And I'm always impressed by the talents of people and I love how the Lord brings different gifts and different talents to different people. And some people are more artistic and some people are more musical. Some people are better at sciences and math or having a strong memory or just having an ability to perceive the needs of others. There are so many different gifts uh, that Heavenly Father gives each of us and I always value seeing that in all the people that I meet. So I tend to learn a lot by most anybody that I meet and really appreciate all of their various talents and abilities. I appreciate you watching my demo and I certainly hope that you enjoy the rest of this painting. Thanks so much for tuning in.